Today we're going to take a look at replacing the master cylinder fluid level sensor on this 2001 Dodge Intrepid with a 2.7 liter engine. Now as you might imagine this is actually located inside the master cylinder. Now this is one of the reasons a red brake light may come on in the vehicle. Could be because the fluid level is low. That's certainly a good place to start. We want to make sure we've got adequate brake fluid level. But also the parking brake could be applied. Those are good things to check before replacing your level sensor. Or the level sensor itself could be faulty. Now we don't necessarily need any tools for this. There's just a couple plastic tabs on the back side here and an electrical connector. So this goes through, it clips into place. It's a little tricky to sneak your hand around the back side here. So some people might like to use a little bit of a screwdriver or a hose pick type tool to pull that apart. I'm going to try it with my fingers first. I can reach around the back side, get my fingers on the tab, and then I'm going to leave the electrical connector in place. It gives me something a little bit better to grab onto here. There, and I've got it released, and I can pull it out of place. Now this doesn't actually come in contact with any brake fluid, so we don't have to worry about any leaks at this time. So I can disconnect my old one. Might even be easier to connect my new one, plug it into place. I have to go back over here, align it with the hole, clip it in until it feels good and locked in. Give it a couple pulls, make sure it's engaged properly. And just like that, we've gone ahead and replaced the fluid level sensor on this master cylinder, this 2001 Dodge Intrepid.